today you're at Casanova Fish Tacos in San Diego. My business started 14 years ago where I was laid off from my job at that time and I started this business three months after. We survived a pandemic, a recession, and we still sling fish tacos, some of the best fish tacos in San Diego, so we're proud of that. We're very proud of that. It's been a lot of work. It hasn't been easy. There's a lot of ups and downs. Not a restaurant background, not, not a chef background. So I had to learn the hard way, as people say sometimes. So it was a blessing in disguise. Now we, we, we're we lucky and we're blessed that we have a following of people that love our food, that love the consistency of what we serve in, and the comfort of the experience more than, more than anything. So um, I couldn't be any more prouder than this. My team, obviously they're, they're the ones behind, behind that grill. Uh, we are behind that grill, even though I'm an owner, I'm still in the back. Uh, where's my, my comfort zone, you know? So 14 years ago, this journey started and, and, and then let's go for another 14, you know? You never know, so. All right, so now, fish tacos. Where do you start? Why do you pick? Let's just start with the classic. The Baja style in our in our menu is is different than everybody else's. Everybody else is over battered the fish. We like to showcase the fish, so we don't over batter. We like to batter just to give it enough crisp so you can taste the fish, not hide that flavor, you know? So it comes with, with the traditional pico, pico de gallo salsa, the tomatillo with habanero to give it a nice kick, and our secret aioli that uh, we make in-house. Uh, if you're more into the unique flavors, unique takes, then you gotta try the ginger. The ginger fish taco by far is one of the crowd's most popular uh, choices in more of an Asian fusion to the, to the taco. It's a grilled fish with uh, Asian spices such as sesame seeds, ginger, dried ginger. We can put a cilantro, lime, and garlic cream in a teriyaki glaze with sesame seeds. It's just a high five in your mouth. It's insane. We have a Peruvian fish taco that we take out of the Lobo Saltado traditional dish and we convert it into using the same ingredients but with fish instead of steaks. French fries, uh, cilantro aioli, it's got uh, grilled uh, tomatoes and cilantro is, is also very unique. We got the, the pibil, the cochinita pibil is a traditional dish in Mexico City, down, down, down uh, in Mexico and we took that, those flavors as well and we showcase them in, in making the fish tacos more authentic to the region that I choose. Uh, so when people from that region come, they can relate and it's like, oh, okay, you got something here where it's not something like, oh, you just throw something in there and like, ah, okay, it worked. So I try to be as true as possible when it comes out to creating new tacos, new experiences for my guests. And we don't put anything on the menu unless it's 100% approved by the customers, not by me, by the customers. All right, so if you're looking for the next experience for your next event, Come and check us out, Castanova Fish Tacos. You can find us on Instagram, Facebook, uh, Google, Yelp, any any social platform that you can think of. We are out there. So try us out. Find us wherever we are, wherever we are out. Because um, since we are a catering company, sometimes we do special events and, and we invite people to come and try us out. So Casanova Fish Tacos in San Diego is the place. You gotta come, definitely gotta come and try something different. So best fish tacos this side of the board. Last but not least, want to give you a big shout out to E-Money for giving me this experience. Taste the blessings. Thank you so much for making the trip and, and giving us a shot among, I don't know, hundreds of other places that you could, have, you could have gone. But definitely, we're going to raise the bar for you. All this talk that I've been doing matches those tacos. So, <laughs> so you'll be back soon. And, and, and you know where to find us now. So E-Money. We appreciate you, brother. Thank you so much for, for the exposure, for showcasing what we do and what we pride on. So, thank you. What's going on, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Taste the Blessings. I'm your man, Big Money, and we're in for a treat. Checking out Casanova Tacos, taking over San Diego, California. They've been doing their thing for a while, so I'm just catching up. <laughs> I watched them make all this delicious food, so I'm definitely excited and can't wait to try it out. The staff was amazing. You know, they had this beautiful event going on. This is called the Underground. So make sure you follow the social media to keep up. Make sure you come out for this event. It was packed, good music. Um, this is definitely a place to be, especially after a long week. Look out for the next one. Enough talking, let's get into it. 
All right, guys, we got three delicious tacos to try. Fish tacos, his specialty is fish tacos. We have the brand new, we just made it to the menu, uh, the Al Pastor fish tacos, not pork, it's fish. Same marinade, uh, just like you would ma marinate the pork, we infuse the fish, same fish again, uh, white fish, we infuse it with that, we put cilantro cream on it, and then we make with the uh, adobo, we make an aioli out of it to, to, to enhance the flavor. And you get a little bit of grilled pineapple on top for sweetness, and that's all it takes. This one here has got the pineapples on it. These tacos are hefty. That's a lot of love in the taco, man. You know how I feel about al pastor tacos. It's definitely one of my favorites, so. Never thought about trying it on fish. I'm diving in. <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. Oh yeah. He know what he doing. I taste the marinated al pastor flavor. Man, the sauces are good, flavorful, definitely homemade sauces. But the grilled pineapples, man, it just gives that little hint of sweetness with it as well. So this is a winner, man. New item alert. <laughs> I gotta go again. Mm. Mm. You doing something special here, man. It's so crazy. I never thought I liked fish tacos like this. Like, this is good. I taste that Al Pastor flavor, man. It's like playing tricks on my mind. <laughs> I definitely see why this is new and on the menu, so I recommend you definitely come try this out, Charlie. The flavors, man. I got like a flavor bomb going on right now. And as you can hear, this beautiful event is still going on. People are still here, don't even want to go home because they're having fun. Leave away from your home, long week at work, come out and have a good time with your family and enjoy good food, good music. Check out the underground. Next, you have the popular sweet ginger fish taco. This is a grilled fish, same fish, we use the same fish to fry or grill. So this one has a little bit of a fusion to it. So we got a um, grilled fish seasoned with secret ingredients. And then we, we uh, grate fresh ginger on top of it. We do a serrano lime and garlic cream in a teriyaki glaze with sesame seeds. Give it a little sweetness and spicy at the same time. So uh, this is one of the popular ones uh, people like something different. So that will be the one to your go to. We got another grilled taco here. So let's check this one out. I'm excited, man. I'm just going right down the line. And he put two pieces of fish over here. This place is not stingy at all, man. They want to make sure you get your money's worth and experience. And I feel that love already. Big bite gang. Man. Yeah, they loaded. Mmm. Wow. Mm. The flavors, man. I would say since I've been here, this is the first time I experienced good flavors that like got my mind confused. Big combinations, big flavors. I believe this is the one with the ginger in it too. Yes. And they said this was like everybody's favorite, so I see why. Mm. Oh yeah. It's even got like a little kick on it too. I like my heat, so this is good. <laughs> this is good, y'all. Look at all the sauce out the back, man. You see that? Casanova tacos. I didn't know you before, but I know you now. I ain't gonna forget you now. <laughs> mm. My man is doing it right. And that's what I love about finding out about these hidden gems. These flavors, I know you're not gonna find nowhere else. Not like this. Mm. Finger looking good, Taco. Said good job coming up with these recipes. I'm tasting the love, Hector. I'm tasting the love, man. You need something to wash <laughs> this down, so why not a Cadillac margarita? Get a white tequila in there, sweet lime uh, mix, and then you got a little bit of spicy around the rim, which is called uh, tahin. So enjoy. I'm gonna cleanse the palate. I had to try this lime margarita now. That is so good, man. So good and refreshing. Got the tahini around the rim. Yes, this is good. You know margaritas are my favorite. <laughs> Frozen ones. Mm. 
It was hot today too, so this is perfect. Damn, man, two for two. I got no complaints. One more to try, guys. One more. What you have here is our classic uh, Baja style fish taco, which is very lightly battered. You got a um, white fish, very mild, very meaty, very buttery. Then you get a pico, the traditional pico de gallo salsa. You get a little bit of that specialty cream that we make here in house, and a tomatillo with habanero sauce that uh, adds a little kick to it. So when you take the first bite, you should be able to experience all the flavors in one shot. So good luck. This is that fried fish taco guy. So I'm excited. Look at that, y'all. I love fried crispy fish tacos, but. This is different. One thing I liked about this too, he said it's lightly battered because he wants you to taste the flavors coming from the fish. He wants the fish to be the star of the show, so that says a lot to me already. All right, big bite gang. Let's check it out. Woo! Mm. <laughs> mm. Man, Hector, man, this is Good. Three for three, y'all. Kobe. <laughs> yes, man. This is good. This has got a little bite, a little heat on it, too, but packing with plenty of flavor, sauces. I can taste that fried bat, but the fish, like you said, is the star of the show. Because I'm from Maryland, traveling to San Diego the first time, so maybe I'm late, but I'm glad I'm catching up. But if you're from here and you don't know about this place, you need to catch up. This is good. Remember the name, Casanova Tacos, y'all. This is unique. Love finding places like this. All right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed everything I tried and showed for you today. Casanova Tacos, guys. Remember the name. Look them up. Follow them on your social. Check out their next event uh, called The Underground. So find out when it's coming next. If you need them for catering and events, make sure you hit this guy up because I see why everybody wants them. This is official. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Keep sharing, taste the blessings out there with everybody. I want to keep growing this foodie community together, guys. I'm in San Diego for the first time. Where are all my Cali food buddies at? Let's connect. Let's keep growing, guys. I'm doing this for y'all. Let me know where I should go next. Make sure you like, comment, and share, guys. And like I always say, if you make one step, God makes two. And just like that, your blessings will come to you. And we out.